consider the probability distribution. And then we see our table below. The mean or expected value is A, 0 0.08, B, 1, C, 1.5, D, 3, or E, none of these. Well, in order to find the mean or expected value, I've listed the formula below. We need the sum of x times p of x. So, let's do this by hand, and then I'll show you how to do it into the calculator. Here, we have our x. Here is our p of x. So, in this case, it would equal x, which is negative 2, times 0 0.1, plus 0 times 0 0.2, plus 1 times 0 0.1, plus 2 times 0.2 plus 3 times, let's see, times 0.4. All right. Now all that is going to equal 0.2. Point two plus, I'm sorry, that is a negative point two. I didn't put my negative sign there. Negative point two plus zero plus point one plus point four plus 1.2. And if we add all of those together, you get 1.5. So for this problem, the mean or expected value is C, 1.5. Mentioned in the beginning, we can also do this on the calculator. I'm using the TI-84, so I'll bring up the calculator. Turn it on. First of all, we need to go to, let me clear this out. Uh, oops. First of all, we need to go to stat, edit, enter. We see our L1 and our L2. We need to enter the data into the calculator. L1. L1 is our exit. Oh, it doesn't look like a very good L1. I'll write it up here. L1 is going to be our x. L2 is going to be our p of x. All right, so let's go into the calculator again. Remember, I went to stat, edit. Let's enter the information from the x, that would be negative 2, zero, 1, 2, 3. Now we need to enter our L2 information from the table. Remember, L2 comes from P of x. So to get to L2, we just arrow over. It's going to be 0 0.1, 0 0.2, 0 0.1, 0 0.2, and 0 0.4. Okay, now that we have our information entered, we need to go to STAT, arrow over to CALC, and arrow down to two of our stats and hit enter, 
L1 for our X list, L2 for our Y list, frequency list will leave blank, calculate, enter, and then 1.5 is going to be our mean. To get the 1.5, you have to arrow down. And there you go. There you go. There's your answer. So that's how that one is done on the calculator.